Our next stop is Indianapolis for the Pacers game. Thanks to Tim, the awesome driver. <laughs> we made it. I met Tim uh, last year. Now every time I have to go from Indianapolis to Chicago, I call him up. Cool guy. Last night, the halftime show for the Pacers game was pretty awesome. And now I'm flying to Denver, Colorado, so I've never been there. Today and tomorrow, I'm gonna ride trials with some local trial bikers. It's a pretty funny story. I just, I, uh, I wrote on on Instagram like, hey, I'm uh, I'm going to to Colorado. Anyone around? And I got like messages from guys that I didn't even know they lived there. And uh, there's all trial riders there, so it's a pretty big scene. I can't wait to discover Colorado. Just outside of uh, Denver, just got off the airport, built my bike, put the other tires on, trusted the locals to find a cool spot, and I must say it's pretty cool. A few moments later. Luckily, this is soft. It's fucking gnarly. Oh, man. Man, I smashed my head so hard on the floor. That you went head first? I went head first. You must be in smash your face. So too soon, too soon. Yeah. No, I just want to be sure I'm okay. Yeah, I don't want to yeah, be injured, yeah. man. Yeah. It's weird, man. Yeah, it is weird. Because of the, because of the because I'm so tired. Yeah. It's like I don't know where I am. Yeah. So all of a sudden, you're in Colorado, like right off a plane. Everything's all. No, oh, no. It's just it's weird. Yeah. Didn't sleep well. Man. Take a little break. Go over to the nice big rolling rocks. We are next morning, and I had to take myself. So I learned how to do this after the World Cup in Antwerp, in Alter, sorry, you know, uh, beginning of the year. And I broke my ribs four weeks before and then I had to compete. So yeah, I think it's broken again, or a minimum heavily bruised. So I'm gonna go try and ride with the guys, but um, yeah, I have to be realistic and I have to save myself. NBA shows next week are more important, so. So here we are, downtown Alder, next to the river called. Uh, 7G Fine Park in Boulder Creek. Okay guys, special news. Robbie, you didn't tell me about it. 
Yeah, we got Kristen over here. But you got a one of the only uh, female a female trial biker. Oh my god, a middle-aged suburban mom <laughs> trial. <laughs> That's so cool. Hey, how are you On doing? a Belgian bike. Uh, yes, exactly. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> the matching shoes are purely accidental. Nice, nice. Not a bad place. Not a bad place. Good vibes only. I'm really happy now because uh, I had a lot of question marks with those rips, but uh, I don't think they're broken. I've taken a lot of painkillers, so that might be the reason I don't feel it as well. But anyway, I can ride. There was so much at stake. Imagine I had to cancel the two remaining halftime shows. That would be a, a nightmare. So we're here in Boulder University. It's a very cool place. It's full of obstacles everywhere. So ladies and gentlemen, the first trial skateboarder in the world. So you got the whole city and the university and then just like one mile away you got like mountains where you can do trials, climbing, rafting, mountain skiing. biking, skiing, you name it. So I met up with Sasha. Sasha is an Adidas Terex and Red Bull athlete. She's a climber. She lives in Boulder, Colorado. I always wanted to snowboard in the US, so... Here we are. Check. Check, check. Climber and a biker went snowboarding. Wait, why are you going down the mountain, not up the mountain? Yeah, for one. After a three-hour flight, now in Milwaukee for the Bucks game. Really looking forward to that. I did it last year. So I had such a good time in Denver and in Boulder. So I met a lot of friends. All right, Mr. Bile, there's your floor, your room number. If you need anything else at all, don't hesitate to let us know. Okay, thank you. My pleasure. So now I'm going to go to the arena, which is right there. I can see it from my hotel room. Uh, bikes are built. Took me a while. I don't know. I wasn't awake yet. <laughs> And so yeah, now set the course and it's only noon and then at um, 7 p.m. tonight I'm gonna do the halftime show for the Milwaukee Bucks. So let's see how long it takes right, ready, to get the stuff off. Three, two, one, go ahead. Watch your back.
for sane. The mighty heaven.